guys, welcome back to my channel and Merry Christmas to you all. Love this time of year. So last week I did a Christmas makeup tutorial on my channel. I will link that down below for you guys. And today I am doing my favourite Christmas uh, festive lipstick. So I tend to do this most years on my channel. It does change every year um, and these are my top 10 lipsticks that I like to wear around Christmas time around the festive period um, mixture of nudes reds mattes glosses and every single one of them is drugstore or affordable um, apart from the first one which isn't drugstore but it's affordable so yeah let's just get started so first up is my non-drugstore one because it's from Sephora but it's still affordable. It's a lip balm. So this is the Sephora Moisturising Lip Balm and it's in the shade Cherry. This is just a tinted lip balm. So as you can see this is just a really hydrating moisturising lip balm with a bit of colour. So it has quite a lot of colour actually and I love this colour. It's perfect for this time of year, the festive period. Um, and it's just a really really nice lip balm smells amazing it smells of cherries you can taste it as well it just smells so nice and yeah I just love this color and this is only seven dollars from Sephora so it's a really affordable option too next up we have this Maybelline color sensational lipstick in the shade rosy risk so I actually wore this in my Christmas makeup tutorial from last week it's just a very natural um, nude everyday kind of lipstick but it has that hint of pink hint of red in it so I think it's really nice for Christmas time it's more of a wearable Christmas lipstick more natural more everyday more comfortable um, it doesn't last all day though so you will need to reapply but these are really affordable as well they're about six or seven pounds so yeah I really like this color it just suits my fair skin really well Next up we have a gloss, so this is the Colourpop Ultra Glossy Lip in the shade Here's To You. So as you can see there's not much colour to this, it's a pretty much clear lip gloss, but you can see all the sparkle, all the glitter inside of it, so it is perfect for Christmas, perfect for the festive period because it is so sparkly, it does stand out a lot, that's why I like to wear this around Christmas time. It's natural, it's subtle, but it is super Christmassy. So these are around about six or seven dollars and they're non-sticky. They are really comfortable to wear and yeah, I just love this color. Next up I have another ColourPop Ultra Glossy Lip, but this is more of a creamy uh, formula and this is in the shade Aquarius. Now this is just a really nice muted red toned um, subtle lip gloss. I think this is perfect for Christmas time if you are looking for a subtle, natural, more wearable everyday kind of lip gloss. This is such a pretty feminine colour. I absolutely love this lip gloss. It's so, so nice. It's also really creamy. Um, it lasts a decent amount of time, but you will need to reapply throughout the day. These are around about six or seven dollars from Colourpop, and I just, I just think this is a really nice nudie Christmas makeup. It is lovely. Next up, we have another one by Colourpop, but this is one of their ultra blotted lips, and it's in the shade Zuma. So these ultra blotted lips are like your lips but better. They are matte but not drying, um, but they're completely matte now on my lips. There's no transfer or anything. And they are really, really soft and comfortable to wear. They don't dry out your lips. They just literally look like your lips but better. This is quite a Christmassy color, I would say. It's a nudie red, I would say. Um, and yeah, you can top this with a gloss, like sometimes I wear this and I top it with the Here's To You gloss, um, just to add a bit of sparkle, but I just really like wearing this around this time of year and it's really comfortable too, it lasts all day as well, it's really good. Next up we have another one by Colourpop, this is the last one and it's a blotted lip, not an ultra blotted lip this time, and it's in the shade Drip. Now this is a very nice red, this is a muted red, not too bold, it's more of a natural wearable everyday kind of red. Um, it is matte, it is completely matte, but it's not dry and it won't dry out your lips at all. I love these blotted and ultra blotted lips by Colourpop 
and this colour just screams Christmas to me. It's not too heavy, it's not too bold, it's not like your classic traditional red, but it's still a very nice Christmassy red. I just think this looks really nice and this would go really, really nicely on a Christmas day. It won't be ruined by your Christmas dinner, you might need to top up, but it will look really nice throughout the day, so I really like this one too. Next up we have an L flip gloss and this is in the shade Red Kiss. So I actually really like this lip gloss. You might think, oh, there's nothing much to it. What's so special about it? But it is a really nice lip gloss. There is absolutely no stickiness to it at all. Nothing stickiness to it. Smells really nice. And I just think it's a really nice natural red. You might want to wear one of the other lipsticks that I mentioned and then top it off with this just to add a bit more gloss. Um, yeah, I just really like these. And these are so, so affordable. They're like five or six pounds. And yeah, I think it's really nice for Christmas. Next up we have this L'Oreal Tinted Lip Oil in the shade Hot Cerise. I love this. It's one of my favourites. First of all, this smells absolutely stunning. I love the smell on these L'Oreal Tinted Lip Oils. I've mentioned these in quite a lot of my videos because they are literally my top favourites of my lipsticks. And look at the colour on this. This is a perfect, festive, glossy, but still natural, everyday Christmas lipstick. I love this. Now we're starting to go into the more darker reds now. I only have two left. So my next one is the Revlon Lacquer Balm in the shade Provocateur. I like this, it is one of my top favourites, but it is extremely bold, so I would probably wear this with no eye makeup, well obviously mascara and eyeliner, but I would wear this with a completely stripped back uh, makeup look because it is such a bold lipstick, like it doesn't really go with the, the makeup that I've got on right now, but then again, everyone likes a red lip, well most people like a red lip, I'm not so keen myself, but this is a nice creamy one, it's not a matte drying one. It will come off throughout the day, you will, you will need to reapply, but it is a nice comfortable one to wear and really affordable option too. Now my last one I've saved to last because <laughs> there's a reason. I have mentioned this in my previous videos. This is the Colourpop Ultra Matte Lip in the shade Creeper. Obviously I have a mini version. This is going to be hard to get off, that's why I've saved it to last because it's going to stain my lips and everything I think. It's definitely going to be hard to take off so I'll try and take it off as quick as I can after swatching it but um yeah this is your classic red matte lip my application is going to be terrible for this by the way because my mirror is ages away miles away and yeah it's just not going to be good because i don't really wear matte lips but we'll give it a go oh my gosh i'm scared I think that's the best you're going to get with the application for that one. But this is your classic Christmas matte red lipstick. This is the ultimate red, to be honest. It is a nice ultra matte lip. I have worn it. It does last a pretty decent amount of time. It's very bold for me. I, I wouldn't normally wear this kind of lipstick. It's too much for me. I much prefer nude, subtle lipsticks. But I know a lot of people like to wear this. And it's a nice one to wear on Christmas Day because it is completely matte. So it will last all day. And it's not going to dry out your lips too, so because it's a really nice formula. The Ultra Matte Formula by Colourpop is a really nice one. But yeah, I'm going to take this off now and then I'll carry on talking. <laughs> Let's hope I can take it off anyway. Oh. <laughs> so as you can see, this is what it's done to my lips. This is how my lips look now. They feel really sore from scrubbing just now. And they've completely stained all around my lips. So I'm going to try and cover it up with a little bit of foundation a second. So yeah, just bear that in mind with that lipstick that it will completely stain your lips and it's an absolute nightmare to get off, so. Which might be a good thing because it lasts all day, like you might find that a really good thing, but 
to me that really annoys me when I can't get my lipstick off it drives me nuts so I don't tend to wear this very often but I know like a lot of people would like that and it is a classic red so that completes my top 10 favorite festive Christmas lipsticks 2022 I hope you liked this video and I hope you found it helpful if you did please give it a big thumbs up down below make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're not already so you can see all my other videos and thank you so much for watching guys and I hope you have a wonderful happy Merry Christmas bye